Hello, my name is Karak City 2 and welcome back. Project Ozone 3 Kappa Mode playthrough. Last episode I started getting into some AA stuff and realized it is pretty heavily gated. Um, I hadn't uh, quite realized that when we first started. Um, but always good to uh, find that stuff out. Um, obviously, don't know everything about this pack yet, so we're kind of learning as we go. Now, in regards to the sword that we remember we <laughs> managed to lose, apparently, that I didn't know, there is, is there like another, ah, yeah, <laughs> so there is another page to that. Uh, don't know why it's on like the second page. Uh, I don't know if there's like a reason for that, but uh, yeah. So that's where the sword went. It went there. So when we get the next sword, um, we'll just delete the uh, we'll just delete this one right here. But uh, yeah, I still feel like that was a bit. Um, I don't know. I wouldn't have turned these in obviously if I had known my sword would disappear. But uh, it still feels a bit weird. I guess we could turn in the uh, assholes now. I have ones. And hopefully it won't make the... Yeah, it's already been turned in, so it's not going to make it disappear. Would have laughed, though, if it had gone. Alright, yeah, still just kind of voiding everything. And uh, just getting some levels, basically. That's just odd to get experience, basically, at this uh, time. I may... Uh, if we need another mob in there, we'll figure that out. I just don't want to deal with... <laughs> All of the mob drops at the this moment. I just hate dealing with that and filters and all sorts of stuff, and it's just such a pain. So we'll just kind of leave that to run. Um, let's see, I think I'm just these chests are a disaster. <laughs> this is so crazy. Uh, all this stuff. I mean, this is all mob drops, and this is kind of like mod stuff, and this is just kind of blocks. But I mean, it's still a bit all over the place. Um, but last episode, we got the sulfur, and I crafted up a couple more of the sprinklers, because uh, they apparently stack, so we're up to 117 of that sulfur stuff uh, for now, and then this is just kind of, as I'm doing other stuff, this is gaining stats, and we're still waiting on this... One over here, the Pharanum and the Potato. We need the Lavender Seeds, so Pharanum, Potato, Gravel, Lapis Lazuli Ore. So Lapis Lazuli Ore, just kind of waiting on that. It does seem to take quite a while. So anyway, um, today I think... Uh, I think we're gonna have to start getting into some more mods here um, if we want to because I really would like to get to a um, before well that's kind of what I'm working towards that's like the main goal I think I'm working towards at the moment getting a so there's a couple things uh, we need to do and one is actually I may change my mind here, actually. <laughs> um, I know I said I wanted to get an A, but I just had a thought as I was thinking, because we need a lot of blaze powder for all these ingots, and I want to, well, <laughs> I was thinking, should we kill, I'm just, should have thought of this before I started recording, but I'm thinking, should we get some wither? Kill a wither? We need to kill a wither. Anyway, so I'm almost thinking, I mean, obviously we can't do that. Wouldn't it be funny to see withers flying down here? Um, but that's not going to happen. Um, No, the reason I was thinking about the Wither, because it drops the Su-Premium or whatever. No, not that one. Su-Premium. It drops this. 
And if you want, you can... Oh, maybe you can't. Oh, just kidding. I was thinking you could get four of the previous tier, but I don't... I think that's disabled. So... Like, you can't get four Prudentium for this. I think that is disabled, actually. Yeah, there's no way to... All right, just kidding. That was, uh, I think that's disabled for Kappa mode. I was thinking if I could get Supremium, I could get a bunch of these, and then I could craft up the Tier 4 seeds, but that would require Astral Sorcery, and... All right, so change my mind again. Yeah, so I was thinking, yeah, if I could get the red one, I could get four of those, but that is disabled. Um, so, just kidding. All right, change the thought. So, I think Mechanism. Maybe we should start looking into Mechanism. Um, because that is a gate. The circuits appear to be a pretty big gate for a lot of things. One is the ME drive, which is kind of what I was wanting to get. So we're going to have to get that at some point. And also the pneumatic craft stuff. And I don't know if that is gated behind. Um, I actually don't know if that is gated behind anything. I don't even know where to start with pneumatic craft, actually. It's been so long. Uh, TNT compressed iron, right? Air compressor. Is that, like, gated by anything? Emerald furnace. Puff alloy. Eh, not really, but this stuff is so much easier to get with nuclear craft. Actually, it may be the only way to get it, now that I'm looking at that. Alright, so it looks like that's gated behind nuclear craft. <laughs> oh my goodness, so many different things. And nuclear craft is gated behind... No. Wait a second. Alloy. So. Alloy furnace. Yeah. To get the tough alloy. But you need. All right. So is there a way. Casting. Molten tough alloy. All right. Well, there we go. We can do it in the. The smeltery. It looks like. A one to one plus one. Tier 4 again. Ah, laser. Alright, there are so many different directions we can go here, actually. Because now I'm like, oh, what about a laser? Maybe we should start getting a laser. We could get a lot of these ores. And again, we're back to this. White laser lens, pink slime we're going to have to get. Which, I mean, that's not the end of the world. That's That gates a lot of stuff. Paraboron, refined obsidian. All right, no, just kidding. And pneumaticraft. Is this pneumatic? Yep, that's pneumaticraft. All right, so can't get that yet. So it looks like we're back to mechanism. All right, which is fine. Uh, I actually really like mechanism. I think it's a fun mod. Let's just see if there is. There it is. So what? Pressed by explosion. Uh, that is going to be Metacraft. That'll be this. Compressed by explosion. All right. Uh, TNT. There we go. Let's get started for two days episode. Talked for almost 10 minutes there. Signalum. Sulfur. We have no signal. <laughs> uh, what was Signalum again? It was gold. No, it was Electrum, Redstone, and... Redstone and that in this. It's definitely uh, pretty cool that I'm really touching on a whole bunch of different mods here to progress. I really like that. You know, we got Batania, we got some Blood Magic even, we got that uh, Lordcraft. We got actually additions, Industrial Engineering, Embers, I mean, Tinkers. So many different mods that we are touching. All the different Dimension mods we've been to. Like, there's four right there. Twilight Forest, Deep Dark, well, that's vanilla, and uh, Erebus, so, yeah, very cool, I'm, I'm digging it, Thermal, so lots of different kind of 
mods we're having to progress through. So a little bit of everything, which is, wait, what am I doing? That's energetic. I didn't need energetic. <laughs> oh my goodness. Signalum, that is, I'm totally pulling a blank here. Right. Redstone, silver, and copper. I can do that in the thing, can't I? Man, it's... Yeah. Redstone, silver, and copper. Why is, like... That was, like, so... It's been a while since I've done that. Why don't we do a whole bunch? About 15, 5, and... 2... I can't make these in a thing, can I? I can do that. Okay. Wow. I am making this way more difficult than it needs to be. Oh my goodness. There we go. I thought there was a... Yeah, I thought there was an alloy smelter recipe. I just noticed there's that... ...thing there. All right. Uh, very, very slow, though. So, TNT... Yeah, that's <laughs> that's a thing. Requiring signalum for TNT. I have some sulfur in here, I think. Yeah. All right, and then we will probably. Comp oh man. I don't really actually. I want to use the small one because that doesn't make it. Well. No, we'll just build out a thing for. We'll build out like a. A little platform to blow up this stuff because TNT will like destroy the, the platform if I do it over there right TNT doesn't blow up obsidian right oh my goodness I am testing my vanilla nods here that's for sure Three. there we go I always turn this into like a wither, wither killing platform right over here. But all right, there we go. Now I'm like TNT won't destroy obsidian, right? That has a blast radius of like or a blast resistance of quite a bit. Ninety nine. There we go. At least we get four out of this. So that no. There. Man, I love that. Do do do. Sixty-four. Um, I guess let's throw down two stacks of iron. Might as well. We're gonna need a bunch, so should I also get and I have iron for days. It's kind of nice not worrying about resources for the most part. Um, just because it was so difficult to Greg Tech New Horizons. In this pack, you kind of have resources just kind of thrown at you. Um, can I... I have my... That. All right, you light TNT on fire, right? Oh my goodness, I am... So clueless sometimes when it comes to vanilla Minecraft. Like, does it need a... Yeah, I thought I could do that. I know a redstone signal does it as well. All right, so we lost half a stack in the process there. Throw that back in there. Throw that away. I like to keep a nice clean inventory, otherwise I get all sorts of confused. All right, uh, not gonna get too far into that, but I wanted to do that because... Um, no, where? Lost it again. Where's the mech stuff? No. No. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's like the energy. Thing, isn't it where you put the energy in there we go so 
First thing we need to do is the Metaldric Infuser. So what are we looking at here? Osmium, not a problem. Redstone LA. Uh, we should be able to get in the thing. Yep. Graphite is just... Yeah, it's pelted charcoal. Easy enough. Uh, do I have charcoal? <laughs> I do. I have some right there. Let's just throw this all in there. Alright, there we go. So, graphite. Red oil. Silicon. Do we have silicon? I actually don't even know if we have silicon. Do we have silicon yet? Oh, you can get it from Surge Core Size. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Let's do that. Go. Silicon. I really need to get the things that let you just do power off these. <laughs> um, instead of having to worry about coal and stuff. Uh, let's do like 16, I guess. There we go. And then I'll just kind of get this going. Because these will probably take a while to smelt up. Totally screwed up that ratio. Oh, that's actually not too bad. All right, so that's an ally. Osmium, we got that, we got that. Steel casing. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. Now I see why I was locked behind Pneumatograft. It is locked behind the pressure changer. All right, change of plan again. <laughs> we keep changing plans here. We are going to have to go through Magnetic Craft or uh, Pneumatic Craft before we can open up Mechanism. Um, let's take a look really quick. The Nuclear Furnace. Yeah, that we can craft up. Well, that's a bit annoying. You have to go through each tier. I wish there was like a... Like you didn't have to go through each tier to craft that. But, all right, change the plan again. We're going back to here. So what are we looking at? Speed upgrades, item life upgrade. What's the items never spawn within machines this upgrade is used in? Oh, that's cool. Used in air cannon, drone, harvesting. Well, you do get 10 from that. Oh, easy. Set. Yeah, and speed upgrade. Oh, man. Lubricant. <laughs> Lubricant. We have to. Ooh. Ooh, <laughs> all right. I'm gonna have to look into how to get this. Distillation tower, oil, diesel. Holy cow. All right, so not gonna be, I don't think we're gonna be doing that anytime today. Is there any, like, I doubt there's like a easy, no, there's no like easy way to do it in that. There's this refinery thing. How do we get heavy oil? 10 to 1. Hot crude. All right. So let's not, uh, let's not look at that one. We'll come back to that one. This one we can do. That one's easy. Let's go do that. Man, that was terrifying, that recipe. I don't even know where to start with that. I mean, a distillation tower. I, I know how to do that works, but uh, those mods never, uh, never done that. Um, Lapis. Uh, it's not speed. Um, item. Item life. Nope. There we go. Alright, there we go. I should probably craft up a crate. I have a chest right there. 
can't remember how many, but I have a thing over there. <laughs> so I can never remember how this dang thing is made. Sticks, I do need. Do need another chest. There we go. And, uh, oh, got to light this up. Go away. Go away. All right, so, like, why isn't this? I feel like this happens a lot. Why is it not seeing me? Like, why is it passive? Now it sees me. I've noticed that a lot. Uh, exploring, like, like, I felt like creepers didn't notice me until I attacked them. I don't have it on like peaceful. No, peaceful they wouldn't spawn, would they? No, of course not. Difficulty, normal? I don't know. That, that's so weird. I really don't know what's doing that. Do I have something on me that, like does this do that? No, I don't know. Anyway. Um, where am I gonna do Nomadcraft? Nomadcraft requires a decent size kind of area. About, but over here ish. All right, that goes in there. This goes in there. Pressure tubes, easy enough. Get some glass. I'm down to like no glass. I'm down to like no sand either. I need uh, I need to upgrade this so it gets more sand, but I still don't think it's going to produce enough to build up a, a buffer like this is. Um, just don't feel like hammering stuff down right now. Alright, at least that gives us two. I guess we'll just borrow this one for now. So, tubes... I'm gonna need a. <laughs> I'm gonna need it over. I'm gonna need a uh, crafting table right there. Right here. I have no idea how much of this stuff we're gonna need. Let's do, I think, what did we get, 16 out of that, I think? Yeah, that should be, be for a little while. Don't need that anymore. All right, it's air compressor. Compressor. All right, tough alloy. What did we say this needed? It needed Lithium and ferroboron. Ferroboron is boron and steel in that. Um, I did get boron for the armor, right? Yes. So I need... How many do I need for the air compressor? Oops. We need four, so technically that's like four boron, isn't it? So four boron, steel. And we're actually almost done with that, so that's cool. Hopefully the, that doesn't mix. I don't think, like that won't mix with like iron, will it? No, it only mixes with steel, okay, cool. And then lithium. We have lithium. I feel like seen lithium somewhere. It will be in the deep dark if anywhere. Be my guess. All right, I'm gonna have to go find some lithium. It looks like I don't have it anywhere. I think it's in the deep dark. Let me go search for that, and we will be back.
and I am in the deep dark and I just wanted to point out I have some lithium. So as I expected, it does indeed spawn in the deep dark. I was doing, we can see like kind of like a long, I think it would probably be easier to find it. the, you just kind of do, yeah, that's probably, here. I just got to be careful with the lighting. I don't want any that grew thing to spawn. I'm probably easier if you just do the biggest or excavator thing. <laughs> Almost like lagged a little bit there. That... Oh, that just mined out a huge area. And there's more lithium. All right. So let's just get the rest of this and we will head back. There we go. Get out of the deep dark. Likely to be eaten by a Gru. Oh no. So with this, we will be able to get the tough alloy, I think. Yeah, it was lithium and the, the ferro boron, which we have in the thing, which is the steel and the boron. And I got a whole bunch more. Well, not a whole bunch, but I did get some more boron in there. I'm going to do this in here. I'm assuming this will give us four ingots. Yeah. Yeah, it's giving us four ingots. And I think we put, put eight in there. Well, we put four. All right. So this is One to one gets you two. Oh, right. That's why. I, so I put four of each and then I got four of that. And then one to one gets us two. All right. So you actually got quite, quite a decent amount from that. All right. So I'm pretty happy with that, I think. I guess we don't need to use all that up. Um... I don't know what to do with these ores. I should just, my goodness. <laughs> um, they're kind of just ending up in this chest, unfortunately. I don't know what to do with them quite yet. Oh, and stone in there, lithium, world. Magnesium is a new one that we got. Red stand doesn't need to go in there. Cobbled toe stone doesn't need to go in there. Granite, that should be added to this thing. So. I guess I don't need to I have tons of coal. Yeah, I don't really need to save it. All right, did that finish that? Up? Yes, so there is that. Let's pour that. So that should be that. And this is led with is that the only way you can do it? You have to crush the stuff. It's a bit annoying. You can't do... Oh, I guess you can, but... No. There is no other way to do that other than graphite dust. Seems a bit weird. I'll pulverize it down. Lead. Forget how many I put in there. Luckily, you do get multiple of this, so I should probably just craft those up in large numbers. 
I'll just do the one that we need at the moment. So luckily we have already been to the deep dark and got all that sorted out, so we didn't have to. That wasn't too bad. All right, so uh, let me get the rest of this air compressor uh, crafted up and we will be back. And there we go. That should be everything for the air compressor. Wasn't too terrible. So we'll just plop this down right there. You rotate that. Yeah, you can. Where I want it. Maybe one closer. Not that this really matters. All right. So you put basically put fuel in. The air compresses the air. And then it'll go out into these things. And then we need to put this in a compression chamber. Uh, so that's right there. And this will get us the transistors. So pressure chamber wall. Ooh, extreme alloy. You do get 16 of those. How many do we need? All right. Advanced plating, we do know how to make those. What else do we need? Ooh, four advanced plating. We need greenhouse glass for this. 16 of that. That's just a hopper. And more advanced plating. All right, uh, none of this stuff is too difficult to make, actually. I didn't look at the extreme alloy. Wait a second. Wait a second. So we need this alloy furnace first before we can get into this there's no other way to make this which i mean not the end of the world that's easy all right so there we go now we're gonna have to get into nuclear craft here all right i was kind of avoiding this so steel frame tough alley we got all yeah we got all that now now we have that but I didn't realize this was locked behind the hard carbon. A lot of the stuff gets easier to make with the alloy furnace, so that's not the other world. Oh, but this. All right. Well, it looks like that is the next thing that we are going to have to craft up. Um. So we're going to have to get energetic silver ingots. We need to end steel ingots. Enhanced machine chassis and steel chassis and steel ingots. All right. So looks like we are going to have to progress into that again. Oh, that's funny. All right. Well, we started with Pneumatocraft today. I didn't get far into it. Um, Pneumatocraft refinery. I wonder if that will get us the uh, that lubricant. I don't know. Uh, but a lot of the stuff is locked behind the yeah a lot of the stuff is locked behind the alloy furnace so all right next episode we'll come back and we will oh there's a loop no that's actually an acid for the the circuits and next episode we'll come back and uh progress a bit towards or we'll get the nuclear craft Um, the nuclear craft alloy furnace. All right, that's going to be it for this episode, though. So thanks for watching, and have a good one.